for many years, and I've had the privilege to work with them on their last two franchises. I believe they are building their greatest game yet. Let's take a look at Quantum Break. Quantum Break. One exclusive. E iruan ez zuten erakutsi, eh? A ber ba. Gogotzen dago jolasa ikusteko. The number one killer is time. It destroys us all. When Paul came back, he came back wrong. Older, changed. He took away the only person who could stop the end of time. Will. My brother. Paul's men from Monarch are trying to stop me. Thing is, when time broke, gameplay it changed Paul, it changed me too. It changed me too. I'm skipping. It's getting stuck. Caught in violent loops. It's getting worse. Everyone freezes except me. Monarch has tech to keep going when time breaks. Entonces da la bacarra, me muero aquel día ahora este volcán. Paul knew this was coming. He's not trying to stop it. Maybe he even made this happen. This could have all been avoided. Well... Will's here. Even when he's gone. A puzzle trapped in broken time. The universe is a singularity. There should be no sound. No light. Glimpses of the first prototype time machine. The origin of time travel. Something went horribly wrong here, but it's scrambled. Oh, 
It's impossible to crack. Come with me. We can survive this together. Give me the device. Don't do it, don't! What if you're wrong? No! Quantum Break, Microsoft 10, Hello, Gamescom. Quantum Break is the next big step on Remedy's 20 year journey of crafting cinematic, story driven action games. In Quantum Break, two different elements the game and an in-game live-action show are fused together to form an entertainment experience that's more than the sum of its parts. Here with me today is Hollywood actor and one of the X-Men, Sean Asmore. Thank you, Sam. Thrilled to be here. I play Jack Joyce who with his newly gained superpowers fights to stop the end of time. The game is about the heroes, the show is about the villains, and one story is told from multiple perspectives. Our goal is to combine a heart-pounding action game with a live-action in-game show into something totally new and unexpected. You will see a lot more of Quantum Break this week at Gamescom. Before we leave, we have a trailer of the show to give you the full picture of the time-bending experience that is Quantum Break. Thank you. Thanks, Gamescom. Vale. Que ya verá cuál es la Gamescom en el trailer va. Try to change things, undo mistakes, only to find there's no changing the inevitable. Baina beltza hori, zia da, hau zia da, frentxekoa. No matter what I do, you and I end up here. And no matter what I do... Es que frentx da. Time ends. Ah, ez? Ostrat, frentxeko, bi aktore mintzat frentxeko azian. Please welcome from Reagent Games. Director Dave Jones. Thank you. Crackdown Nino. Crackdown has always been about innovation in open world gaming. By bringing verticality, over the top player abilities, and four person co op to the genre. Now, open world means go anywhere and do anything. And while we're set to deliver a massive new city for you to play in, it's the Sorry. Epa. It's the anything part of that <laughs> vision where we're working to set a new bar. Today, we're taking you behind the scenes at Reagent Games to show you the vision, the in-engine gameplay, and the technology that is the foundation for our game and the foundation for how we will change the way you play games forever. This is Crackdown 3. Xbox One exclusive. Some people look out on the city and just see lights. I see lives, Agent, burning with hope for a better future. But what happens when evil comes out of the shadows? Jolas acciones que hemos tenido aquí, se les ha dicho nada, aunque la hay cuestión de ojeta. Bueno, jolas eso para ti que la hace. Era que no salto a que te ha dado de esta, bueno. Alturas verdinetan ebildez gezu, ez? Horasea. Crackdown 3 is set in a dangerous new city. A once glistening metropolis overrun by violent crime and corruption. Life in Gangland is an intricate web of dangerous interconnections. 
A dynamic ecosystem with multiple moving pieces. A criminal hierarchy to be dismantled any way you choose. Crackdown 3 will blow up the way you play games today by introducing a revolutionary new multiplayer experience using 100% destructible environments. Wow. Envío me un grupo viral, eh. Envío con chico busca tu alis en guala. Computational power of your Xbox One and experience unrelenting destruction and mayhem. Oh, con solo la gaudana muy tu alis en guala. Just what you can do with a gun. It's the opportunities you can create with destruction. Seor. Gauza apurtuta, partikulekin eta Ez da lan makala hori Bueno, ipin dugu amairan Multijokalaria bimi eta masuean Ideki kamila Olera Hello Scalebound is the biggest game we've ever made at Platinum Games an action RPG where you can free, freely explore a vast, mysterious world on the foot or on the back of a mas majestic dragon. You play as the young man from Earth named Drew, who, along with the dragon Tuban, have been searching for a powerful artifact. To succeed, they'll need to fight through the soldiers of an evil empire and even more dangerous foes. I'm excited to show you Scalebound gameplay for the very first time. Welcome to the world of Draconis. Xbox One exclusive. A moment to show you my damn kitesh. Gucci Zayn eta era kuzi era kuzi era kuzi ola verdu konferencia. Ta ganera joko exclusive ga idea era kuzi. Almost time to rejoin the main unit. That's right. The carrier ship will arrive in about an hour. Good. Por eso antes acción RPG va a ti sango de la. Hoy es un gol sango se llama o sobre drago y engaña. Ah, es más de lo que esperaba. You up, big guy. Yeah, what the hell was that for? I'd get off if you'd ask me to. Use your words. I've never seen a creature like that before. Don't panic. Team, you know I know. Oh, man. Here we go. Oh, yeah? Well, maybe you should hide behind me. <laughs> All right, let's go. Vale, mate Dragoia y Ordena que me analizan Que es que yo chula Verá ocupa tu ahí en Toki bates, o sea Go! 
A ver, Leno, mina ahora usted Leno, Artur. La... Persona de convertir tu hijo, ¿no? Vale, chula una boca. Acción RPG típico. ¿eh? Vale, la persona con cooperativo avisando el lado. Bienvenida a México. Udan. Ladies and gentlemen, head of platform engineering, Mike Ibarra. Thank you. It is great to be here at Gamescom. You've just seen a few of the amazing games coming in 2016. In addition to playing great games, our fans are also passionate about their entertainment. A year ago, we gave you more choice by bringing a new capability, especially meaningful to the fans here in Europe, free-to-air HD television on Xbox One. We've been listening to your feedback, and many of you have asked, will I ever be able to record live TV? Today, I'm pleased to announce the answer is yes. We're adding full-feature DVR functionality to Xbox One. You can record free-to-air TV, schedule recordings, and take your shows on the go. Let me show you how easy it is. From the one guide, I can quickly select the show I want to record. Funziona questa che ti spiega la mia funziona c'è tutta. Tele vista i cosi. Però gravato tutta lì sa te come. Bueno, gravato tutta vai lì siamo su un i cosi lì sa te. Ho visto che tu sono solo. My shows even when I'm not at home. Getting access to all of my recordings is easy. Within the one guide, I just go to the DVR section, and I can see all of my shows. Vamos, que show acá, Harry de Saga Sula, Chan es basado en grabar su cota, pero hoy está con Ani Custo, cuando es el momento. Vamos, que en fin de ambas, 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 que en fin You can also schedule recordings even when you're on the go, and they'll show up back on your Xbox One. Best of all, this is a subscription-free service, and it's coming in 2016. Today, I'm excited to announce the new Xbox Chat Pad. Now you can quickly compose messages, enter codes, and search for games and apps. You also get audio controls at your fingertips and a stereo jack for your headset. Vale, algo te clava tu van mando ahí sarceco. I'm personally looking forward to taking screenshots and recording game DVR clips at the touch of a button. The touch, the chat pad is compatible with all Xbox One controllers and works with both Xbox One and Windows 10. It will be available in November and you can pre-order today. Vale. No, hombre, ya no voy a la aterración esta que acabo de pintar a todo esto que la. We also announced the ability to play Xbox 360 games on your Xbox One. 
Since then, we have been humbled by the response. In just over a month, the Xbox community has submitted more than 3 million votes, and preview gamers have played over 83 years of Xbox 360 games on their Xbox One. I'm happy to announce that all future Xbox 360 Games with Gold titles will be backward compatible at launch. I like this Xbox. I do not know if Games with Gold will be released each month. And retro compatible at the same allowing you to play your top Xbox 360 franchises like Halo, Gears, and Fable on your Xbox One. Combined with support from leading third-party publishers such as EA, Bethesda, Ubisoft, 2K, and many more, I'm excited to announce backward compatibility will be available for everyone for free this November with over 100 games and hundreds more to come. Vale, un hola sensate ongo de la noviembre an. Ahora tengo no noviembre an de Gustius de Valde. We're updating Xbox One and Windows 10 and releasing a completely redesigned experience that will be faster and easier than ever before. November is going to be a great time for Xbox fans. Thank you and have a great week here at Gamescom. Ladies and gentlemen, General Manager, Microsoft Studios, Shannon Loftus. In my 20 years of making games for Microsoft, rarely have I seen a community as engaged and vibrant as the Killer Instinct community. Thank you. At E3, we announced KI is coming to Windows 10. Anything you own in KI, you'll own on both platforms, and we're supporting cross-platform play. And on Windows 10, all of your existing controllers and flight sticks will just work. Today, I'm excited to announce that Killer Instinct Season 3 is coming March 2016 to Xbox One and Windows 10. Vale, Killer Instinct ordena ya con Windows amarrako eta Xbox One erako. Plataforma artean jolastu al izango dela eta X ordena joan edo zein mandurekin ibli al izango zea. Eta Xbox One era... Oh, jolasa, ba hori. Borroca qua. Etas irua rencisona marcho a primia tamashiko marcho. It's been two years since we launched ID at Xbox right here at Gamescom because of our belief in the power of independent games. Since then, we've been blown away by the creativity and innovation independent developers are bringing to Xbox. There are more than 1,000 studios creating games via ID at Xbox today, and it's awesome to see how many are also starting to take advantage of Xbox Live on Windows 10. In fact, every game I talk about today will ship on both Xbox One and Windows 10. So, Get things started. We want to talk vale, about one game developer indie in chat platform I'd like to welcome to the stage a true master of game design. Please welcome the leader of Castlevania Symphony of the Night, Mr. Koji Ijirashi, to talk about Bloodstained. Hi everyone. Hello everyone, this is Iga. As you can see, he's still working on his whip cracking skills. Today it gives us great pleasure to announce cross-play functionality in the Xbox One and Windows 10 versions of Bloodstained Ritual of the Night. Vale, jolas a plataforma artean ere ibilial izango dela. Bazen garaia ja gauza hauek hartzeko, se ez da normala. Gaur egun ez inibilial izate kontsolako baten aurka ordena hori. For those of you who do not know, Bloodstained Ritual of the Night is a 2.5D side-scrolling action adventure game with heavy RPG elements. It recently raised over 5.5 million dollars on Kickstarter. 
まだ B.Wost se ha desagado de la RPG estilo cojo las plataformero bat eta bueno, Kickstarter-en Kickstarter-en bos milioitako crowdfundingera ino iritxiala Crossplay will allow Xbox One and Windows 10 gamers to enjoy and explore the deep, vast, robust and gothic world of Bloodstain together Ah, bueno, plataforma de cojolas te ha dado la Xbox. Esta bueno, ves sorpresa tú que me hago y tú la. Te la digo hasta intento. えっと、このキャラクターですね。ちょっと急ぎで作ったので、えっとですね、この あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あ
And the second was for us to relive the nostalgia of making one of those games again. And now, with the dedication of Microsoft, Thimbleweed Park is going to be coming to Windows 10 and Xbox One. And here is a quick preview of Thimbleweed Park with the pixels so sharp they could poke your eye out. Old school and cojola, ¿sabes? Pixel a toa, aventura gráfica. Point and click. Eta, bueno. Gente a vuelta tic, aventura un bat, espero que se haga Seata, Juda ta gustis. Maniac mansión ecuata. When we announced Xbox Game Preview at E3, we had an outpouring of interest from the development community who were excited to have players experience their games and provide feedback before their full release. Two games have released through the program so far, and we're excited to announce that Sheltered, Team 17's post apocalyptic family bomb shelter simulator is going to be available for download later today. Also, coming soon is a really cool dinosaur survival title, Ark Survival Evolved. It's going to be coming to Game Preview this winter and shipping next year on Xbox One and Windows 10. Let's take a look. Vale, Ark Revival. Atera Gultela, Xbox One era co, tapa en Windows Shaco. Windows Shaco ya va dado, ni va a jugar de Devil's Nest. Baño, Gauss Berry Pillati, que están diamantes. Hola, se me está en su arriba. Oye, o ve tu verga de usted. El rendimiento, la optimización hace. Epa, señala la duda. Momento de ten. Vale. Chuli. Vale, será eso aquí, Satan. Ahí, nice. Está aquí, Sergei Tic. A ver. Versión web. This year. And later this winter, fan fan. Vale, me atendo y chulida la. Total debut in the Xbox Game Preview program. Finally, I'd like to leave you with one of the creepiest and coolest games we've seen in a long time. This game is going to be first on console on Xbox One next year, but you can experience it in Game Preview this holiday. Let's take a fresh look at We Happy Few from Compulsion Games. Momento ate anala ko se bat egonda. Mosqueta bat beretxi baina lasai. London Bridge has fallen down. It's fallen down. Fallen down. London Bridge has fallen down. Take the keys and lock them up. Yes, go on, do it. Lock them up. Yeah, lock them up. Take the keys and lock them up. My family. Everything is quite all right. Sleepy tight. Nighty night. Everything's coming out of sight. My family. Wow, hola. Hau gertuti jarretu arko izango da, epizkat bai zakoar datu itain estilo ez eta, bai osot lehen gokoa. Just last week, we began the worldwide launch of Windows 10. Now I'm super excited about this launch because Windows 10 represents the best version of Windows we've ever made for gaming. 
It starts with great hardware and software. We've worked closely with our partners like AMD, NVIDIA, Intel, and others to ensure the best possible PC gaming experience. Windows 10 introduces DirectX 12, which gives game developers direct access to the graphics hardware, enabling them to deliver, deliver new levels of visual fidelity and performance for PC games. Over 100 game studios are actively developing DirectX 12 games, including Epic with Unreal Tournament and Stardux Ashes of Singularity. And that's just the beginning. Vale. Director Tobatasan and the Final Fantasy team at Square Enix have put together a technology demonstration, Holasak. showing the incredible realism that DirectX 12 can bring to the game. Let's take a look. 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 Jolaz baden, o errendimendu test hoietakon bat, ben. Zeuren ez errendimendukoa o CGI bat izango da, erakusteko direktek izan mabian indarra. Zean batek, motor grafiko potente batek. Windows 10 is built for gaming. As gamers ourselves, we knew it was important that the games and services that you use today work great and get even better on Windows 10, including League of Legends and Steam. So with Windows 10, you can easily record and share your favorite clips and screenshots from your PC games with the built-in game DVR. This means no additional hardware or software is required. And all Xbox gaming accessories are designed for both Xbox One and Windows 10. Windows 10 also brings Xbox Live to PC in a way that adds value for PC gamers. It starts with a built-in Xbox app where you can see your friends, your games, and even voice and text chat from PC to PC and from PC to console. Xbox Live makes your PC games better with cloud saves that allow you to start your game on one device and continue your save game on another. And starting with new games like Fable Legends and Gigantic, they'll have cross-buy so that anything that you purchase on one platform is automatically available on the other but also cross-play, so that you can play with or against your friends on Windows 10 and Xbox One. Now, if you have an Xbox One, Windows 10 allows you to stream your Xbox games to your PC from anywhere in your home network. Starting this year, many of our biggest Xbox franchises are also coming to Windows 10. Killer Instinct, Gears of War, and Rare Sea of Thieves, just to name a few. And as you just heard from Chris, we've got a great lineup of games from ID at Xbox, like Cuphead and Super Dungeon Brothers. See, you've just heard why we believe that Windows 10 is the best version of Windows we've ever made for gaming. So upgrade for free today and try it for yourself. Thanks. Vale, Windows 10 ahí, ya pisca salsa, no la Windows 10 que aplica si va a tocar, que es vos y cuá. Esta gran andy no la ibrindes que zumba plataforma artean. Bueno, Minecraft es cuá, ya repito. Yep. I'm in the wood. The Sarah Chakta was. Last what? Wednesday, we released a new version of Minecraft designed specifically for Windows 10. The Windows 10 edition is a beta and will get, we'll get better and better over time with the help of your feedback. All existing players of the current Java version will get the game for free by logging into the Mojang account. 
And one of the things we love about the Minecraft is the passion the community has for, for the game. We look forward to bringing a steady stream of updates and happy, many new things to play with this fall. Thank you for playing Minecraft and sharing your feedback with us. There is one more thing I want to share. I may be the lead developer of Minecraft, but I've also been working with my two of my closest friends, Daniel and Pontus, on a new game called Cobalt. With Cobalt, we wanted to build something that we could play together with great couch multiplayer and a fun co-op adventure game. Now I'm excited to share with you that Cobalt is coming to Xbox as a console exclusive this October. Here's the first look at Cobalt for Xbox. Xbox. Bueno, mo ya no creo ahora que este juego es verdad. Cobalt dice negua. Xbox será co exclusiva. Bueno, plataforma de bates. Nada, multijo calaria no vendiendo esquetsu. Apesar de ter ido bem e agora está com a tema tendo. Vale, outubro é um bimia da mosteco, outubro. World premiere. Dar Souls. Ay, Dark Souls, Sirua. Uh, Microsoft te gamen. Asco hindú, eh. Veré conferencia de Karchan. Nasketa ematen du ez, Dark Souls de lengua eta Bloodborne Playstation laurako atera zuten gola zanaren Artistikoki Ogerak Vale, maten tu colasa. Ascarraba de la vaina. Asco que es que en un. Hay motel a chen. Y se han colasa. Pisca bloodborne. Había dura. Horizon. Se sabe. Da, forta seian Fujimi kaido ez dakita gazetu godan, egia esan. Egia esan, zirkuito oso mitikoa esan, ez dain. Azaldu berko duk, eh? Eta bai, dar zortzi guztioko, haha. Nene jolaz favoritoa da, beraz. To our honorable and faithful leaders, I want to say thank you. Thank you for your kindness, generosity of spirit, and your concern for our future. At first we rejected you, but that was because we did not understand. We didn't realize how much we needed you. We didn't appreciate that your arrival was a precious gift. Your presence has roused us from our complacency. 
we have awoken from our wasteful sleep and taken responsibility for our future. We have renewed pride in our work. We are once again enterprising, resourceful, and cooperative. Thanks to you, we have rediscovered who we are. And there's no turning back to our apathetic and misguided ways. A new day has dawned, and a brighter future beckons. And for this, we say, thank you. Homefront. Betty Coaes. Coreano que está todo aquí invadido en dicho este lado, o sea, ya lo aldero es si te andaba ya bueno. En Homefront, la revolución, hemos tomado una increíble premisa. Una fallen América ocupada por una fuerza extranjera y construido un shooter abierto al mundo que pone al jugador en el rol de un guerrilla soldier luchando por la libertad. Vamos a mostrarles un breve glimpse de la experiencia de la guerrilla warfare de Homefront, que es jugable aquí en Gamescom. Pero para Homefront, la revolución también ofrece un breve glimpse de la experiencia de la guerrilla warfare de Homefront, que es jugable aquí en Gamescom offer a compelling cooperative multiplayer mode in which you and your friends can form a resistance cell and become heroes of the revolution. We're going to be working with Microsoft to test it out, and we're proud to announce today that Xbox One owners will enjoy exclusive early access to the Homefront multiplayer beta this winter. Thanks. Vale, Xbox One qua ki sa molto la esclusivo qui e multiplayer beta ra qua accesso a ne gontan. Get you those locations. As soon as we can reach the KPA transceiver, we'll download the data. Okay, Isaac, get up to that intersection. Make sure it's clear. ¿Será dispara con Jolasa o motor las tarjetas de la simulación? Ah, vale. Coche bomba. Armai accesorio che alda tu lesche, un po' rocca nei siala. Quando da ori combatti hanno adattato seco. Un momento da te hanno arma per aere che urti da quel disparo da inverno su va da su va. Mira Lucia Hartson da su. Ma te non ha che va a dire va da ora. Causa di rechita. Avantaje, irá hasta acá. Chula, una home from neck. Quiero que se de uno la historia no la era más tenduen. Esta quiero que se una guía escuela. Te hace es que al día en bagui sucede ese modo de un down raidar aquí. Vaya, vaya, hasta el coi chula, una saucan. No, FIFA, deporte que está gordo. We're innovating across the entire pitch to give fans balanced and exciting gameplay. And we're helping every fan compete at a higher level with FIFA Trainer, an all-new in-game training system. 
And finally, we're bringing new and exciting ways to play, uh, play FIFA in your favorite modes. And for the first time ever, women's national teams are in our game. To build on this story of FIFA 16, I'm here to tell you about exclusive news for fans playing on Xbox. That news is all about two things, FIFA Ultimate Team and EA Access. FUTS is the place fans go to live out their footballing dreams. It's the most popular mode in FIFA, played by millions of fans on any given day. And we all know Xbox players love their FUTS. So what's coming this season? Only on Xbox, you'll have more FUTS legends to create the ultimate squad. 60 new legends adding more iconic players. And we'll meet them soon. Vale, ultimate Legends Y se hago de la Es de los Seraco exclusivo This gives you more combinations to build that ultimate squad only on Xbox. And that is what you want. Better squads and better players. Bueno, ultimate we'll team as que en fin de año FIFA ya ahora ca y ya ahora tan virtudad. Leno jolas a iruro y euro saltzen dute, gero FIFA ultimate team ekin beste di dirutza eta ateratzen dute. Ya ja, FIFA lotzar etza taida bihurtzen. Ba, bueno, bea ikusiko dute. And play for less only on Xbox One. But fans, this is a big deal for you. EA Access X members save 10% on FIFA Ultimate Team points, and you can put this to use when searching for that perfect legend. And members get to play first in FIFA 16. Get in the game up to a week early for a limited time before it even hits the shelves here on September the 24th. So this season. Bueno, te haya acceso. Daukatena kontratatuta ba pixkat lehena oti jolaztu ari zango dutela jolazea Great tackle from Gattuso. And Yari Lippmann is the scorer. That was an elegant finish. Well, he's a clever midfield player, Deco. Got the ball again. Such a strong tackler, Javier Zanetti. Oh, that is silky smooth from the Welshman. Real classic Italian defender. Alessandro Nesta. There's a goal from George Best. Well, well, it's a privilege to see that kind of finish from what is a legend. Or legends, Jokalari leyenda que están tienen ultimate team. Berrio Phil Spencer hablará. We know how much our fans love playing FIFA, and we're excited to introduce. The Xbox One FIFA 16 bundles. Both bundles include FIFA 16, three lone legends for your ultimate team, and EA access so you can play FIFA first on Xbox One. The FIFA bundles are available starting September 15th, and you can pre order them today. Bueno, iré a más que te cobrará esta garota que reserva tu letra. FIFA Rekin eta kontsolakin alako zer, pakak, egon goi dira. ...has defined multiplayer Xbox on Xbox Live and serves as the cornerstone of our first party portfolio. This is Halo 5 Guardians. Halo Bost, Guardians. Microsoft en buca insignia.
Gets the double kill, maybe a trip. Gets the triple kill. Brilliant plays out of him here in the winter bracket finals. Bueno, malo, esta vas cosa me arric. Shooter multiplayer también chat down onena, casi casi. Ni en esto es más bien chat. Ahora la con en close combat el juego que tú cuá esta futura instalera onena me gusta. Esta jola es solo una estela de campaña. Arena's Halo's eSports focus 4v4 mode with even stats, an intense mix of Slayer and objective game types. And in Arena, I think this new map that we're unveiling right now will be a top choice in tournament play moving forward. Let's take a look at Coliseum, which has everything that makes a great competitive Arena experience. It's a symmetrical two-base map, which includes a unique mix of elevation and sidelines, and it's purposely built for a wide variety of fast-paced multiplayer modes. Now, in addition to the Halo 5 Guardians game from Invitational happening here at the ESL Arena, we invited two of the top Halo Pro teams in the world, Epsilon Esports and Optic Gaming, to play some preliminary matches at the 343 Industries headquarters in Seattle. Let's talk a little bit about these two teams then, Bravo. Epsilon Esports is one of the best teams in all of Europe, made up of very UK players, including the Buck Twins, Buck 57 and Buck 20, one of the winningest duos in European Halo. Now, Halo has predominantly been dominated by the North American team, so the question was, can Epsilon upset the balance and change the compass needle? And that's it. And on the other side of the stage, we have fan favorite it's Optic Gaming from the U.S., led by Halo veteran Flamesword and the winner of the 2013 Halo 4 Global Championship, Ace. Now, these two teams have never played before, so of course, a lot of speculation on the line of who would come away with the ultimate victory. Now, over the course of the visit, these two teams battled a match after match of intense competition. They all rounded up with the best of three series on Capture the Flag on the new map, Coliseum. I have to tell you, Sims, I got a chance to see each and every one of these matches, and these two teams were neck and neck throughout the entire series, but it all came down to one last game. You know what, let's jump on bad and take a look at some of the most clutchest moments of that final game. All right, so we're going to be checking out... Bueno, we've been the professional Harry Situstela, Aura Saurre. The game is going to be capture the flag, three captures to win, or the top score after 12 minutes. Our two teams will be Optic Gaming, and in blue, it'll be Epsilon Esports. Going to kick things off here with Flames. Bueno, it's a moment to see the first things you're going to notice are the player outlines here. Halo 5 Guardians has made some major investments in Esports features, and some of that is giving players better camera and spectator tools to make sure they can tell the best story they can during a match. Take a look at this, Flames for it picks up the double kill. And now we move across at the moment, it's Jimbo coming back on the defensive. He knows someone's in the cave. Grenier goes in, he spots Ace. Ace has got the sniper rifle, this will be a big kill, which he manages to get. The flag is there, however, he turns around, spots Maniac, takes him down, big double kill, and he gets the return as well. Yes, big plays from Jimbo indeed, but on the other side of the map for Team Europe, it's Bus 20 grabbing the second overshield of the game for his squad, Epsilon Esports. He's going to use that to push into the enemy base and grab the first flag of the match. Take a look at that on your screen. Flag juggling has returned here in Halo 5 Guardians as Buck 20 escorts that flag all the way across the map and overshields. Shield in hand. He finally gets it. Yeah, no, no, like it's in Siena. But in doing so, Sims, Epsilon Esports will go up 1 to 0 with 10 20 left in the match. Moving forward with Book 20 again. He's back in Optic's base and just in their face. And he pushes in. He finds a whole half shield. Takes him down. No problem. Goes for the second pull of this match. Ace comes back for a little bit defensive. He thrusts out. Then all of a sudden we see Flamesock come out of nowhere. He gets taken down. Ace does come back for a little bit of a defensive shot. However, Book 20 says no. He's going to run that straight out of the front bridge at the moment. As we see him moving forward. Takes the flag, jumps, thrusts, toggles, and he managed to clamber up into the blue courtyard. He's going to run that forward. However, he's going to take some shots in the back, but that doesn't matter at all. Oui. He has his teammates <laughs> jump right behind him to get the collection. Yeah, that's why he's forced to go up 2-0, to zero, but let's take a look at that replay right there. Slow it down a bit. Look at that jump, toss, thrust, and clamber using those brand new Spartan abilities to escort the flag all the way across the map, and Epsilon Esports will secure that. Can I move to the Volta? Pistola, Eduki. Para tu garra y se me vuelve todo. Headshot with the Magnum. Sensuit left. He's going to get some defense there. Finds Ace. Grenade goes in. Will he clean up this kill? Yes.
Yes, he did indeed as he thrusts around the corner, finds the salt, takes him down. Another big double kill for Jimbo. But there's more in store for Jimbo here. Take a look at this. The overshield power up is about to drop. Here he comes. Boom! Lands the Spartan charge, stealing the overshield out from underneath the optic gaming setup. Seems we gotta run that back one more time. That overshield power up so pivotal. But look at this. Jimbo with four enemy players on his screen. He swoops in here, landing that perfectly timed Spartan charge. Also uses the thruster pack to grab the overshield. That's gonna have Epsilon East. Mala habilita te da. Era habilito la mata. Es a ni a lo iruan ibili nitsen. Multiplayer en. Eta ordon et sabe no la co habilita te da. Ora en dao de na vez la co. Don't have shield takes him down, grabs the sniper rifle, but you know what, rifle? There's only one minute thirty remaining in the game. Right. He needs to make something happen. Oh, nice one, Sagora. So, man, this is so good. He's going to run that straight out the front bitch now, looking for some support from his teammates, but unfortunately, he just finds Jimbo. Jimbo again with another defensive return. Too much defense here from Jimbo in the back left quadrant of his map. He's going to take one player out. Yes, indeed. Spots the second here on the second, and it's going to be an assist there. But spots the third and uses the ground pound stall. The pressure from Epsilon Esports is just too great. We switch over to Buck. In the last moments of the match, but the clock is ticking down, and Epsilon Esports will win the game two to zero and win the final series with a score of three to one. Congratulations to Epsilon Esports. Tarde a una guerra es un partido ahora es David. Pues que pensé que era cuchín de su tela no la da multiplayer es a lo tal retar a co. Jarrute la va a vi equipo profesional en arte con partida va. Each player on Epsilon is walking away with this limited edition Halo 5 Guardian themed one terabyte Xbox One, complete with a matching controller, a console that will be available to the public, including the digital version of the game, on October 20th. So the players can pre-download. Bueno, console aparecía en moda, en visión mini tatuada, que es o a Lorena, terabyte bateco de tal, bueno, gente de arencha te. Esta ya, bueno, prior de raya en de salto su tema. Así que para que si usted es un fan a un día de animarse a te. I hope you'll join us. Before we go, let me welcome to the stage executive producer of Halo 5 Guardians, Josh Holmes. Thanks, everyone. Thanks, Bravo. Thanks, Sims. Uh, and congratulations to Epsilon Esports on a big win. So Halo has always been synonymous with online competition and was an originator in console esports. With Halo 5 Guardians, we are fully embracing that legacy with the biggest investment in Xbox Esports history. Get ready for the first ever Halo World Championship, coming this winter with a prize pool of over one million dollars. Halo 5 Guardians is the biggest and the most famous Halo game in the world. New Halo World Championship final is going to be a million dollars. It takes our universe in new directions. We'll have much more to share with you in the months ahead. Until then, we have a great game of multiplayer on the show floor here at Gamescom. Thank you. World premiere. The town of Costa del Porto. Burn it! And when he comes to protect the insignificant, kill his friend. Just cause he do. Juego con esta cosa que hace porque os ha sido divertido ahí sante ya gustía que tal o no ya me atendo daña para gráfico que suba re guste nada está aquí quiero relajo y se me ha colado baño baño a en vez de leer que está la pantalla ni se anda Usted es de caos absoluto la jolasa. Vaya divertido ese de naosa. Just cause three. Set the world on fire. December first. ¿Me dicen para? ¿A quién tú vas a tener? Vale. ¿Es que vos serás con Just Cause y tú eres de más suerte? 
Juskals Bia de Valde y Samos. Arrasado a Fanta. Está bueno, Farza Motorsport en Ordua. Dan Greenawald. And in the decades since its first release, over 25 million fans have experienced the automotive world of Forza. Between the return of Porsche in Forza Horizon 2, our partnership with Fast and Furious, and the debut of the, the show-stealing Ford GT, 2015 has already been a great year for racing gamers. But this year is far from over. On the 15th of September, racers all over the world will get their hands on Forza Motorsport 6. The most beautiful, the most technically advanced, and the most comprehensive game we have ever built. In Forza 6, you'll race over 450 Forza Vista cars, twice as many as any other racing game this generation. And every car includes working cockpits, doors, and headlights, as well as full damage and customization. Armed with your favorite cars, tour 26 world-famous destinations, all built to the highest level of detail and realism. And through the power of Xbox Live, compete in epic 24-player races on dedicated servers. Here, all new ranked leagues deliver fast and fair competitive multiplayer. And in leagues, you'll be grouped into ranked divisions based on both your speed and your professionalism. Every week, new events are created for each division. Top racers against top racers for top prizes. In the new career, feel the claustrophobia of racing by headlight alone in the utter blackness of night, and the danger of competing in the rain as tires hydroplane across physically-based 3D puddles. This is as real as it gets. Let's take a closer look. Xbox One exclusive. Bueno, Forza en evolución. Ya ver son Gawata. Euria Sarcea. Joseph Newgarden is a ferocious competitor. He just won in Toronto while racing in wet weather conditions. Having his perspective really helped us deliver an experience that speaks to players of all types. Racing in the wet, everyone calls it the great equalizer because it's the toughest conditions you're ever going to run in. When we decided to do rain, we wanted to do it in an impactful, authentic way. The brake lights, the spray being surrounded by cars, the way that the water shears off cars in front of you, the windshield wiper in your face, it's perfect. We have 148 unique drivable surfaces. Rumble strips, grass, gravel, cement, tarmac. All of them had to feel unique. There's a lot of different areas of the track that you have to make sure are correct. Each with different values for wet and dry. We approached researching this in the most authentic way we could. Going through old race footage, doing our measurements on the track itself, we were able to recreate where every single puddle was placed. I get to drive multi-million dollar simulators, and none of them that I've experienced have had wet conditions built into their model. Hombre, ahora se ando nori, vishia pasatia irutsuzai. It's pretty cool. And all rain is running at the speed of simulation at 1080p and 60 frames a second with 24 cars on track. Piloto profesional batek izatea milioiak postatzen dian simulatzaile batean ez dula esperimentatu euria hain ondo jolasetan hain bete, hostia. Ja limitea dago gauzak ezateko, eh? Ha, ezatea mago grafiko oki hain olako jolasek ez dula ikusi, ba, bueno. Mahondo. Baino, hostia. Tom Clancy's Rainbow Six. Olas, táctico, acción squad. Ta táctico. Tal debate. Antiterrorista, tal vez te haya visto terrorista en Haití. Sandúta nes, hola sabes, oso táctico es una ganera. Berko da ondo antolatza zure taldeakin Bueno, trailer bajarra dute Bueno, trailer bajarra dute 
gentlemen, from Crystal Dynamics, game director Brian Horton. A Tomb Raider variant. It's fantastic to be at Gamescom to present exclusive new gameplay from Rise of the Tomb Raider. Lara Croft is in a race to discover the lost city of Katesh and the secrets of immortality. A ruthless shadow organization known as Trinity seeks this power and will destroy anyone in their way. Lara will need to sharpen her skills to survive the overwhelming obstacles in her way. Xbox exclusive. We join Lara in the Geothermal Valley, a massive exploration space that is three times larger than any we've made before. You can spend hours here collecting and hunting resources, completing challenges, and discovering tombs. Rewards you earn help improve her gear and abilities. At base camp, Lara can upgrade her weapons, craft ammunition, and master new skills. No, I'll do that now. Rekutam raideren, ansera. You can customize Lara based on your preferences and play style. The valley below is guarded by Trinity forces, and you must decide how to defeat them. They think might know something about the Atlas. Constantine's been asking a few questions. They've got the rest back up near the cathedral. I'm gonna pick up Igus and that. Also, so I'm gonna go. Once we finish scrubbing this site, you men can head on out to the rest of them. So what are we looking for exactly? Command thinks the Atlas <laughs> need to be feared. We're looking for something. Anything that might confirm. I'll take a look. Like what exactly? If we knew... What was I saying? All oh, right. If we knew, you wouldn't be looking. Documents, maps, anything that might confirm the intel. <laughs> oh, there. Gráfico que suar, pues en el efecto A que está partícula que está.
It's not his call, but he's gonna put a recommendation in for us both. Then there'll be an initiation ceremony of some sort. So that's it? Some of those guys were on contract for years before training came to play. Ah, there, I don't know. Lurreko lata ba botau eta esplotatu egin du? Hon ere iru ipena izan da Bueno, y chulo son, ¿no? Le doy a abrir con las Tomb Raider una sana, esta Rise of the Tomb Raider Raw. Mire. En Rise of the Tomb Raider, no one will experience the game in quite the same way. Chulo, no me atendo. But that's not all. Before I leave, I wanted to share a sneak peek of the incredible tombs that you can discover when the game launches on November 13th. And tease of the demo we're showing this week at the show. Thanks again, and have a great Gamescom. Ma van dir ja el software res d'ultra acció. Gràcies. Thank you for joining us today. This week you can stay connected to all the Xbox Gamecom news and announcements on the Xbox Daily Live at Gamescom starting tomorrow. This includes hearing more about the games shown today, the platform features bridging Xbox and Windows, and the hardware and accessory bundles that make your gaming experience even better. Today, we showed you our commitment to deliver amazing experiences that define this generation of gaming and delight millions of gamers around the world. By building the best experiences for gamers and for developers, Across Xbox One, Windows 10, Microsoft is delivering on our vision for gaming. That vision is focused on the connection to the community of gamers across devices and in our platform and service, but its very foundation is in the games you want to play. This year, we are delivering what we believe is the greatest games lineup in Xbox history with blockbuster third-party franchises, a diverse set of independent games from ID at Xbox developers, and Xbox 360 games on Xbox One with backward compatibility starting this November. All anchored by the best exclusives available this year. Forza Motorsport 6, Gears of War, Fable Legends, Rare Replay, Gigantic, Rise of the Tomb Raider, and of course, Halo 5 Guardians. And in 2016, the lineup only gets better with exclusive games like Scalebound, Quantum Break, Crackdown 3, ReCore, Gears of War 4, and more. This 
is the future of gaming at Microsoft. Before we go, we have one more announcement that underscores our commitment to first-party games on Xbox and Windows. Please welcome head of 343 Industries, Bonnie Ross. Vale. You don't have to do this. 2015 is going to be an amazing year for Xbox One and for gamers. We've teased fans with glimpses of storytelling in Halo 5 Guardians, with the Master Chief being pursued across a troubled galaxy by Spartan Locke. But there are other stories in the Halo universe, stories fans have long demanded we continue. I'm pleased to announce that in fall 2016, on both Xbox One and Windows 10, we will begin the second chapter of a legendary Halo tale. Enjoy. Windows 10 and Xbox One exclusive. Vale. Xbox One and Windows 10. Hola. Se te sobera, tengo que ver a tu sejo de las... Ah, Halo Wars. Vale, vale, vale. Vale, estrategia gojo, Lasa. Creative Assembly, que usted tenía pensado. Creative Assembly, eh, famosa da, Age of Empires, se vea que item va a ir Está pensado, Jesús va, se jolas, eh, género es verde y está sartuada, es caro. Estratégico a baño, a lo universal mundo. Está un pichet de resumen a si jolas y cuciales se han oído con un X Boss en Baby Mia, Dama Ostan, Gatsen, Denean, Eta, Aurong, Urtean, Sear. Vigue, San, Cruzo, jolas pilla de la Torx Q, X Boss era co. Está una. Parijo, Cala, Linza. Bueno, video yo co salen, saben, saben, no quise posgar este día. Bueno, a ver si anda gustia. Es que ergas con ameno te atigure quién. Y cuyo debut, conferencia. Gordetas a buscar Microsoft que se han suene y duan taguero. Gordetas a buscar las semejas jolas en Games con el acuste que y cuyo debut. Quantum Break que tal vez Eta rigares anda dar souls bata a divis en un espero. Gabri gustia y no la seré. Y custo cotan. Pensad en un anicusco de nuela. Va bestela, aparte, eta esta horrela ere, pentatzen un en Tokyo Game Showrako utziko zutela, en bea ir japonesak izan da. Baina ez gaur pentz, alako, lehenengo aldiz ikusia gameplaya. Bo, gameplaya, bueno, bentzat jolaseko irudiak, ze... Etrez, e iruan ateratzen aizan zen, en trailer bat besterik ez. Eta gaurkoa, trailerra izan da, baina jokua ere ikusten zen. 
Eta bai, e, berretsi jahar ze ez dute aurkeztu, en, e, iruan erakutsi zuten, pentsatzet erakituztela jolaz batzuk batzutan eraguztea, beste atzuk, dak, e, beste atzuk e, amen bakarrik, gamezkonean, eta beste atzuk babietan, adiz alo bat, adiz bietan erakutsi behar raukate, edo Tom Raider. Baina, bueno, jahar software ez dute eraki, baino ikusi ditugu ez, irudi batzuk hortik e, jahar zenak. Eta bueno, zai hon berko dugu jartzena edo beste jolazen informazio ikusteko. Eta bueno, esat, esateko Gamescon amenez dela amaitzen, biar amarretan, goizuko amarretan Gamesconen elektronik hartzen konferentzia dago. Eta guamen izango zaituztegu, e, baita ere komentatzeko, gaur bezala. Eta gero amabitan uste dagoela Blizzarren konferentzia, ez daki bilizarrean egin alizango degun, baina elektronik hartzen da egingo dugu. Eta, bueno, besteri gabe usten zaitugu, arratzalde ona pasa dezazuela. Torren arte, ale, a, jo.